What is going on people? Welcome back to another video on AJ5. So in today's video guys, it's all about scale network and as you guys can see, it has been performing very well over the last week or two. It has been gaining value quite a bit and especially in the last 24 hours, it has gained about near about 18% and currently valued at 0 0.0451 cents. So what is next for scale network is it likely to pump up higher than where it is at the moment potentially heading over the five cents target is it going to drop back down that's what we're going to be going through in today's video looking at its next target and also mainly focusing on is this a crypto to be investing into right now is it too late or is it simply time to hold on to it but before i get into all of that stuff guys if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well as like the video as i am trying to hit a hundred thousand subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys can help me hit that target i will be doing a cryptocurrency giveaway which you guys can join by simply subscribing to the channel and for a bonus entry following me on instagram link to that will be in the description box down below so we are currently looking at the candlestick pattern chart with the Fibonacci scale which I will be using later on in the video to do some technical analysis but as you guys can see we are getting very very close to the resistance level we did go past it earlier today heading into the green zone however we have taken a step back down into the red zone but I will be going through this later on so for now I'm just going to hide this and bring out the usual MACD indicator to do some price prediction as I'm pretty sure that's what most of you guys are here for. So we are looking at the daily chart and at the top here we've got the purple line running across the chart giving us the average value of scale network which is here in purple however the crypto is trading at a much higher value here in green meaning it's performing very well and much better than expected however that also could mean that the crypto may be slightly overvalued due to the major gap between the two figures here but again i'll go into that very shortly so for now let's zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short term traders and then i'll move on to the hourly daily and weekly chart for the long term investors like myself but before i do that guys just a little disclaimer as usual this is no financial advice i'm not a financial advisor Anything I say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make, I will not be responsible for. So zooming into the 30 minute chart here, we are not looking too great. We do have the blue and the orange line looking slightly bearish heading towards the negative direction. Reason for that is, as you guys can see, it has been dropping in value slowly over the last couple of hours here, hitting red candles, meaning it is likely to carry on dropping in value over the next couple of hours, trading at a slightly lower value. However, in the early hours of tomorrow to tomorrow midday, I'm expecting it to start taking a U-turn, hitting more green candles and heading closer to the five cents target is where I'm expecting scale network to be trading at by midday tomorrow to tomorrow afternoon. So approximately over the next 24 hours, we should see an overall increase in value, even though, of course, we are likely to see red candles in between as well. Moving on to the hourly chart, next couple of days now we're looking a little bit too steep, heading towards the bullish direction. The reason is quite obvious here. The, again, the, the crypto has been performing absolutely crazy and has pumped up quite a bit, especially over the last 24 hours. So the graph thinks the crypto is going to keep pumping in that direction and at that pace over the next seven to eight days, which is not the case. So over the next seven to eight days, by the end of next week, the crypto, even though I'm expecting it to be trading at a higher value than where it is at the moment, I'm expecting red days in between because it is overvalued and it is likely to take a little bit of a step back over the coming week before it starts to hit red, sorry, green candles once again, heading over the five cents target is where I'm expecting scale network to be trading at by the end of next week. So now, Moving on to the daily chart, next couple of weeks, we're not looking as steep. However, we still have the blue and the orange line looking quite bullish, heading towards a positive direction. Meaning again, guys, an overall increase in value is what is expected from scale over the next six to eight weeks. So in this case, we're talking about mid to late November and early December. I'm expecting it to be heading over the seven cents target, potentially getting close to eight cents is where I'm expecting scale to be trading at essentially towards the end of the year and also getting closer to the 10 cents target towards the very end of the year and early next year as well because 
not just scale but i'm also expecting the crypto market to be bullish for the rest of the year over the next three months guys and especially bitcoin as well i'm expecting it to potentially get very very close to hitting a new all-time high over the coming let's say four to six weeks but there will be more updates on that as to you know what i'm expecting and where i'm expecting it to head towards and what targets it is likely to hit so let's get rid of the macd indicator and bring on the fibonacci scale so as you guys can see we are currently literally just below the resistance level i'm expecting it to hit the resistance level over the weekend drop back down into the red zone and potentially by mid to end of next week the crypto should be back into the green zone and once it's back there it should slowly start to hit more green candles heading upwards from there on for the next few months and potentially heading into the dark green zone heading over the seven eight cents target by november december and higher than that but if you guys want regular updates on scale let me know in the comment section down below and i'll be more than happy to do that for you guys on a regular basis so let's get rid of the fibonacci scale and head into the coin market cap website here we can see the trading volume has gone up crazy numbers guys 150 percent up in the last 24 hours making it over 53 million dollars in trading guys which is again a huge increase in trading reason is quite obvious here the crypto has pumped up quite a bit so we are seeing a lot more people trading the crypto from both buyers and sellers point of view and as you guys can see we've got 87 percent of the people being bullish and 13% being bearish over the last week 30% up not just scale but the crypto market has been on the green side over the last week including bitcoin as well which has had a major positive impact on the crypto market and over the month it is up 41% however we know that majority of the pump did come from literally the last approximately 10 days so let me know in the comment section down below how high are you guys expecting scale to go in 2024 i've seen a lot of comments saying 15 20 25 cents even 50 cents which again 50 cents might be a bit of a push however 10 cents is a realistic figure for me so i'm expecting it to essentially get very very close to a 10 cents target towards the very end of this year and early next year we should be able to hit that target but comment down below what your predictions are and what are your thoughts on scale hitting 10 cents is it likely to hit it anytime soon or is it not let me know in the comment section down below and on that note i'm going to end the video here guys i just want to say a massive thank you to every single one of you who have been subscribing liking commenting and just supporting the channel in any way or form and especially all the subscribers out there thank you guys so much as it helps me out a lot and means a lot to me as i am trying to hit 100k subscribers by the end of the year and on that note i'm gonna end the video here guys i'll catch you guys in my next update which should hopefully be later on today or tomorrow until then take care and peace